Hello. It is I. Sorry, I didn't set this camera correctly. And I wanted to show you guys before I got started on my vacation scrapbooks what I had been doing. <laughs> and I wanted to do this, show you how I was going to do these before I started my scrapbook because I know that was going to be a long process and I wanted to do it. So get it done in one shot. Um, so these are my stamp sets that from the Stamps of Life, uh, the different kits, um, excuse me, sorry. And I just got these today in the mail. I had a little mix up with my credit card, had to update it, and so they took a little longer to get in the mail. But it's all good. I got them. And these are, I'm imagining Lion 2 Stamp, yes. And Squirrel, uh, predictable if nothing else. No. Um, so I wanted to show you my epic fails um, and how I messed it all up. So I cannot color with markers. That's just it. This is the absolute best I did with my markers. So I kept it <laughs> naturally. And it's the thing here. Okay. And here's one of my acorns. See how I went out of the lines? That one didn't turn out too bad, I don't guess, other than going out of the lines, which I did not like. And here's my squirrel. Which looks horrible. So. I don't even know at this point which ones, which markers I used. So. This was another failure to me. Because you can see the lines. And this I had done two layers with it. Don't like it. Okay. Um, this is when I decided I would just do colored crowns, color pencils, excuse me. Uh, I kind of colored him in, and I'm not real wild about how it came out, but I liked it better than these. So, I took all the markers back, and I picked up this cheap set, which it's not the cheapest one they had, but... Um, what's that brand? The yellow one, Crayola. Um, it's eleven ninety nine as well for a fifty eight pack, but they were on sale, so I didn't get the fifty forty percent off. <laughs> so I went ahead and got this one, the Fine Touch. They don't tell you what color they are on them or anything, just plain old generic color pencils. This is what I came up with. And I know you can still see the strokes there, but it doesn't bother me as much as the marker ones. I did the little baby lions. I did not do any big ones. I've stamped out multiples because I, I thought I'd be able to color them all. But child coloring is not for recreational activity to me. Sorry. Here is my squirrel. I just finished him. I don't know. I mean, it's it's doable, I think. And my new fishies. I think they came out awesome. And then some hearts that I put that I dot that I cut, but then it dawned on me that if you die cut them, they fit inside each other. Because I saw it on one of the cards. And I'm like, oh, hello. So it didn't really dawn on me. I finally figured it out. So that is the plan. Um, so I have them stamped. What I'll do is tuck them in here. And then I'll just color as I go. Oh, it's so pretty. It's the only one I could do. So these are going in the trash. And, oh, you too, buddy. I did take my jelly roll... Secure a jelly roll. And color in their eyes. And his mouth. Her. His. Her. Whatever. And his eyes and their eyes. 
just to make them pop back out because when you color over them it does kind of leave a film but also be careful if you get the cheap ones like me because you can see right there barely anyway uh whoops get on back up there now where y'all going um it'll streak so be careful um and i did use the memento black tuxedo black to stamp them in because that's what everybody else I saw online doing what did. So what I'll do is die cut these out. And I bought this huge pack of cards from most likely Tuesday mornings. Tuesday morning. And so I'm going to take some of these pre-made cards. Make some cards out of them. And voila. I will have some cards made. And finally get to start using my stamp set. On another note, I printed all my vacation pictures out last night. <laughs> and so much for one album. Um, I believe this is 50 something odd pictures and there are multiple ones on a lot of them. But I am... Oh, I love that one. It looks so much better on my phone. But... <laughs> Um, I am going to do eight by eight and a half by eleven photo albums. So um, I plan on getting all my paper together tonight, and then we'll be ready to rock and roll with some layouts. So, uh, anywho, if you guys have any questions, feel free to ask. Um, I think it was Miss Val that had asked to see what I do with them, and girl. Them alcohol markers, the water markers, they weren't working for me. So I'm doing the best I can with, you know, I've already invested into this. So I want it to be able to be something I can use. <laughs> Anywho, I hope you guys are having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye. Okay, so I did them. I'm not really wild about them all, but I did them. That one's okay, I think. <laughs> this one, I don't know what I was thinking, but it's done. I'm tired like this. And this one came out pretty good. I like it. I wish I had put those in the behind it though. And then the fishies. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed. See you later. Bye. Oh. Or I started my scrapbook because that from the stamps of life, which I did not like. And here's my score. This is what um are on them or anything. Just I've stamped out multiples because I I thought to me sorry. And then some hearts that I punched. So these are going in the trash. Most like some of these pre-made cards. Make some cards out of them. I printed all my vacation pictures out last night. <laughs> um, I believe this is ready to rock and roll with some layouts. So I think it was Miss Val that had asked to see what I do. Okay, so I did them like this. And this one came. And then the fishies. Mm -hmm. Of course, the guy who's going to be very much of the hot seat, Pat Riley.